sorry for the lateness here we are sorry about that i was doing some cleaning and i not lost track of time but i tried to yeah so um i hope my feet not ashy i hope my arms are ashy um if so well <laughs> i'm just gonna see the ashiness okay so today um i'm gonna try not to be here too long because um it might look crazy but thank you guys um to those of you that are new i just want to do some house um keeping things um um you are not blocked if you guys don't know um the chat is disabled so if you want to know why i disabled the chat please um check out the video that i will uh, check out the video prior to this so my live before this i do explain so i'm not going to explain it again here i already said what i said so um the chat will be disabled so for the notice pro uh, probably for a good while because i need to concentrate okay all right so that's my choice all right and so that's just basically about that so welcome to everybody um today i will be um doing the forearm planks um we're gonna do three three forearm planks and three regular um planks and then we're gonna do side planks so two side planks on one side and two side planks on the other side um last live we did one and one so now we're going to do two and two i'm going to show you the uh, modified version and also the regular version doing a regular um side plank or what have you um so that's just basically it about that so um what else um i was supposed to do an upload but i didn't um i had a lot going on i still have a lot going on so I, if you guys have been seeing, I've been uploading my vlogs. I've been uploading a whole bunch of stuff. Um, so I'm still uploading stuff. I just uploaded a vlog right before I came on the live. So um, I have another vlog that I have to edit that I did a, I did a vlog the other day. And I vlogged today. I wasn't going to vlog today, but I was like, might as well. I um, went to Dollar Tree and um, <laughs> Dollar General today. So I was like, let me do that. So I did those. So um, today we're just going to do mostly, I believe, floor exercises. I'm sorry, sorry floor stretches and um we're gonna do probably like warrior one warrior two we're not gonna do utasana because it is hot if you hear something loud it's because i have a fan going on because it is really hot in this hallway but yeah so the fan going on so i apologize if you can't really hear me um i'm gonna hurry up and um get started um i'm probably only gonna be here for 30 minutes because i still have to um do a lot of things i have to work on this week i have to do my nails um, so I'll probably work on most of the way today. I have to bleach the knots. I have to do a whole bunch. So I was doing a lot of cleaning today. So that's what took up a lot of my time. So that's just basically about that. So we're just going to get into it. So those of you entering the room, we are going to start breathing. Um, I like to start getting right into it, giving you like a little bit of updates and things of that sort. Again, the chat is disabled. You are not blocked. The chat is disabled. If you want to check out why I disabled the chat, you can definitely check out the video prior to this one. I'll put it in the iCar. I'll try to or I put it at the end of this live so you guys could check it out, okay? So that's just basically it. So thank you to those of you that have showed up. Thank you to those of you that are joining and participating. I hope you got your block and your strap, and I hope you are ready to start your yoga session, okay? And one more thing, if you, um, if the 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 YouTube, if it, if it, if it freezes or okay, it just um, hold, hold, the, um, hold the pose or go into your safe pose or what have you, and then um i will come back to um then i'll be back because you know how you youtube do it just stops and whatever the okay, case so don't fret i will be back so yeah so you have to worry about that so again hey to everybody thank you for joining and i appreciate it a lot and if you want to leave a comment you can at the end of this video okay all right well at the end of the um replay okay all right, so now we are going to, um, oh, and I'm also inside because, I'm sorry, I'm um, inside because it's about to rain out there and I didn't want it to rain on my head. So um, just to keep it safe because we're supposed to have like a thunderstorm. And that's why I'm kind of like going kind of fast because I think it's going to be a storm. So I just want to hurry up and get this done or what have you. Okay, so sorry for rushing, but yes. Okay, so now, all right, um, here we are. We are going to start the breathing process so i hope you guys got everything together if not you can catch up whenever you can um get into a seated position if you want to lay down you can go right ahead or if you want to sit like this it's really up to you but sit in a comfortable position to get your breathing together you're going to breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth as your eyes are closed my eyes will be open just to make sure that the app does not freeze so you're going to breathe in and breathe out breathe in Breathe out as you let your mind settle into 
your practice that you have going on for today and to make sure that you're letting everything be positive and continue to breathe i will be right back continue to breathe i will be no never mind <laughs> continue to breathe i'll be right back i'm sorry continue to breathe and breathe as you slow down your mind from a long day that you had and you're letting your mind rest and getting it in tune for the yoga practice for tonight as you breathe in breathe out as you clear your mind and get serious with your yoga practice. Breathe in and breathe out nice and slowly and nice and easy. As your throat relax and as the air circulating through your nose down to the back of your throat. As you breathe in out easily. We're going to bring your hands at heart center and you're going to set an intention for tonight. And as you set your intention for tonight, you're gonna to make sure that it's positive and whether it be the intention for you or for someone else is really up to you. All right. So welcome to everyone. Thank you so much for coming and I really appreciate everyone for coming. Um, so now we are going to, oh no, stay in a seated position, I'm sorry. I'm gonna stay in a seated position and we're going to just loosen up ourselves little by little. And we're just going to sit in a seated position, comfortable seated position, it doesn't have to be like this. We're going to do some neck rolls, some side neck, some side neck stretches just to get our body into the stretching so stretch your head to the your neck to the left to the right bring it to the front back i'm gonna roll it around one way one direction and then we're gonna reverse the direction whichever direction you went just reverse it doesn't have to be the same way i'm going just do what your body tells you and reverse it again. Now we're gonna bring our right arm up and put our left hand behind us. We're going to take it and put it on our left knee and we're gonna do a slight twist and we're gonna breathe each breath. We're going to twist some more so we're just getting a nice light twist. And as we're breathing. And we're gonna gaze over our left shoulder. Release, bring the left arm up, bring it to the right knee, put your right hand in the back and gaze over your right shoulder and continue to breathe. And each breath can twist a little bit more. If you can, if you can't, that's fine. And look over your right shoulder. Release, we're gonna breathe, bring our arms up, bring your hands back to heart center. Up, bring your hands to heart center, bring it back up. Hands to heart center, breathe one more time. 
and hands to heart center okay so now we are going to go to our backs i'm gonna lay down and we're gonna take our right knee we're gonna extend our left leg with our feet both our feet flexed and we're going to flex and point the foot on the right flex and point the foot and we're going to circle it and circle it the other way it doesn't matter which way you go whichever way you can let's do it again and we're going to point and flex the foot again now we're going to take the left leg and we're going to do the same thing point and flex the foot circle it circle it the other way point and flex the foot circle it again we're just warming up the muscles it's just to warm it up you've probably been on your feet all day like me most of the day and you just want your feet you just want that stretch okay now we're going to take our right leg again and we're going to open up the hip flexors which is located here this is good for splits and pigeon pose okay reverse the direction and it's good for other poses as well but those are the main poses that a lot of people know so yes but it's also good for other poses as well lizard lunge and things of that sort okay we're gonna bring the leg down do the other side open up the hip flexors have the foot flex because we're engaging trying to engage all the muscles your extended foot should be your extended leg i'm sorry should be um your extended i'm sorry the the leg that's extended the foot should be flexed as well you can't see it but yes that was a tongue twister all right reverse 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 <laughs> all right i wish i could play some music for y'all I gotta, I gotta get that together all right okay all right so bring that down now we are going to take both of the legs up and we're going to put them here and we're going to do windshield wipers so windshield wipers okay do it to your speed it's really up to you this is also to help with opening up here and getting some nice stretches we're going to stop here and we're going to turn our head to the left put your um, arms in um, field goal post or cactus um, cactus arms or field goal post arms and if you want a further or deeper stretch take your right foot and put it on top if you cannot do that that's fine you don't have to but make sure your gaze is to the left side okay I'm looking this way because I got to make sure okay but if you can't do this you can do this okay it's really up to you if your knees doesn't go all the way if they're right here right here is is really up to your body please do not force your body if it's pain if you can't do it you is okay it's okay i don't want to go into the hospital say marquita told me to do that no okay all right so just make sure that your body allows you to do it if it doesn't that's okay i always got a malfunction with the clothes Okay. All right, take that off and then you're going to lean on it, um, to this side. Put your foot there if you can. If not, that's fine. Your gaze should be going to the right. Um, cactus, cactus arms. These are cactus arms like this. Okay, I'm sorry, I should have shown you that before. Or field goal post arms, okay? Okay, I don't want y'all seeing my toes. <laughs> Notice. all right this is a nice stretch here all right if you once again if you feel pain get out of the pose and go into the neutral in a, in a neutral pose okay if you feel pain go into the pose like this okay go back to the starting position all right now you're gonna go back up all right now we are gonna do some um, some hip. Uh, I'm sorry, y'all. My email got distracted. We're gonna do some hip. So take your um, some um, pelvic lifts. So you're gonna take a mini. It's like mini bridges. So you're gonna take your um, 
your your legs. I'm mean, sorry, your foot. Your foot. I'm sorry. Um, my my nail. And you're gonna make sure that it's um, fist width apart so right here. So make sure your feet is. I mean, so your heels are right here, as you guys see, kind of close to the buttocks, but not really. And we're going to lift up. All right, we're going to lift up, put your hands down on the mat like this, and we're going to lift up on three, one, two, three. Make sure your chin is in, and you're going to hold your stomach in, and you're going to bring it down. Bring it back up. Down, bring it back up. Down, bring it back up. I think that's the fourth one. We're going to do two more. I said four a lot. <laughs> up. And one more. Up. Remember to breathe. All right. So now. All right. So now we're done with that. And we're going to. Um, now we're going to um, rock and roll to a seated position. So cross and uncross. Cross. <laughs> I do as many times as you can. Um, I did probably a little bit too much because I like it because it's fun. Okay. All right. So now, um, you're to oh, I didn't think I was gonna do this. So you're gonna bend your leg like this here, if you can. If you can't, that's fine. Your foot touching your inner thigh, and we're gonna stretch to this one side. So we're gonna stretch. We're gonna move. Let's kind of move the sits bones. I'm sorry. Move the flesh from the sits bones. And we're going to bend forward to this um, to this foot. If you can't, you, if you got to be here, you'll be here. Same thing as a forward fold, but it's kind of off to the side, okay? So we're going to bring the arm up, and we're going to bend, bend, bend. And have a nice stretch here. So this is what it looks like. Okay. All right. We want to take the other side. I mean, yeah. Whatever you do on one side, you must do to the other side. Bring it over here, and you're gonna bend and you're gonna breathe. Remember to breathe. Remember to breathe. You don't want to be, you know, suffocating. But remember to breathe. Okay. All right, and we're gonna bring it back up. Now we're gonna do a wide-legged forward fold. We haven't done this in a while, and we're going to do that. Oh, but before we do that, dang, the yoga strap. Okay, so before that, come back to this, and then we're gonna do the wide-legged fold. Okay, I'm sorry about that. So take your yoga strap. I totally forgot about that, y'all. So go back to laying position, get your yoga strap. I'm so sorry, I forgot. Bring it up here, your leg up here. And then this is the modified version. This is the oh, <laughs> the extended version. I mean, um, the advanced version. If you want to go like this, little circles or medium circles, but more advanced. Um, if your if your practice, if you feel that your practice is more advanced in this area, you can do this. Um, do not do this if you can't or if your body can't let you. Again, I don't want anybody going to the hospital. Don't say Marquita said to do it because I didn't. Um, other direction make sure you listen to your body okay this also opens the hip flexors up wide okay so that's why we're doing this before the wide legged fold so we can have more of an opening okay so sorry about that y'all Again, reverse. Okay. All right. Now, do this if you can. If not, that's fine. Stretch, stretch, stretch. And then I'm stretching all the way here. I'm a little stiff. You don't have to do this, but I, I need to do this. If you want to, you can. If not, Okay, I feel a stretch on my inner thigh. Okay, there we go. All right, other leg. Modified version is this. 
Okay, if not, you can get a, a deeper stretch and I'm going to bring it around town without hitting the background. Let me get another background, y'all. <laughs> Somebody said my background was nice too. I'm like, that. I had this for like, I think two, two and a half, three years, I think. I think, I don't know. But yeah. Other direction. And remember in yoga, whatever you do on one side, you must do to the other side. All right, bring it up here. I'm a little stiff today. I'm working on my leg come out. It can, but it's just it's just plain it's just plain me today. Okay, over here if you can. If not, that's fine. Okay, bring it back down. We're done with the strap. Okay, now we're going to rock and roll coming up. I'm gonna do a few. Alright, I did a couple. <laughs> All right, now we're gonna turn around and we're gonna do the wide-legged forward fold, okay? So, have the feet flex. As you guys see, my foot is flexed here. You can't see my other foot. And we're going to lower down through the waist. And we're gonna bring it down here. And here we are here. If your head can't touch the floor, don't worry about that. But my head does. And you get that nice stretch right here in the inner thighs. And then you could do a side stretch as well. And you do another side stretch as well. You still get a, you still feel a stretch here too. And come back to the front and bend. All right, now we're going to get into tabletop position where we're going to do cat and cow. We're going to do a few of these. Make sure your hands are like this, like suction cups. And we're going to do cat and cows, and we're going to hold our stomach in. And we're going to do a few cat and cows. Make sure what your feet to do, what my feet are doing, and cat and cows. Okay. You're going to inhale, arching your back. Exhale. Inhale, exhale, inhale, look up, all right, we're going to do a few more of these, and then I'm going to show you what child's pose is, if you guys don't know. Before we get into our planks and other things that have to do with our arms. Alright, so this is going to be your child's pose or safe pose. You can have your legs closed like this. Or you can have your legs open, which is more comfortable for me. And be like this. Put your forehead on the ground. And since we're going to be doing a lot of planks and stuff like that. Um, if you want to alleviate the, um, the pressure, you can rotate your wrist as such. Okay. So this will be like your safe pose or this is like your reset button, okay, to reset, all right? So now we're going to get back into tabletop position and we're going to do opposite arm and opposite leg. So back to tabletop position, we're going to take our right arm and left leg. So we're going to start off like this, your left leg, right arm, make sure you try to hold your stomach in and you're going to breathe and up and we're going to hold it hold it hold it bring it in we're going to do 40s that's one two remember to breathe three breathe four breathe bring it down now we're going to do left left arm right leg Start out like that. Bring your right leg up. Left leg, stay here. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Hold your stomach again if you can. Bring it in, out, two, 
out, breathe, three, out, four, out, down, okay? Ooh, sorry, y'all. All right, so now, back into child's pose. We're going to rest, and if you need to do this, please do. All right, back in the tabletop pose. Now we're gonna go into downward facing dog. And then we're gonna go into our plank. So it's gonna be three regular planks and three forearm planks. If you didn't see the last slide with the forearm planks, you will see what forearm planks are. If you can't do it, that's fine. I understand, but yes. All right, so downward facing dog. Oh, I'm blurred. That's not good. Oh. All right, downward facing dog. Breathe, make sure your hands are like suction cups like this. Breathe, and we're gonna go into plank. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Right leg, hold it, left leg, hold it, hold it, hold it. This is wrong, this is right. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Knees, chest, and chin. Okay. Here we are here. Take a little rest. I gotta look crazy. I don't want look like that. <laughs> oh, I don't want to look like all the time. Like, leave your hair alone. It looks good. <laughs> all right. Then we're facing dog. Breathe. Breathe. Breathe, plank, this is the second plank. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Right leg, left leg, hold it, hold it, hold it. Hold your stomach in and breathe. Hold your stomach in and breathe. Make sure the eyes of your elbows are pointing out, as you guys can see. And knees, chest, and chin. Breathe, breathe, that's the second one. Breathe, 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 breathe. Now we're gonna do the third one, and then we're gonna do three forearm planks. All right, plank. I'm sorry, downward facing dog. Oh Lord. Now we're gonna go into plank. Okay, breathe, right leg, left leg, breathe. Breathe, 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 breathe. Hold your stomach in. Breathe, 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 breathe. I'm gonna do chaturanga. Bring it down. All right. So now we're gonna do the forearm plank. Forearm plank. You're gonna go kind of like in a in a sphinx pose, and then you're just gonna basically lift yourself up. So this is the forearm plank. We're gonna do three D's. So ready? Breathe, 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 breathe. Bring it down. Got two more. Got two more. Two more, two more. Dang, I'm hot, y'all. I got this, um, I got this sweat band on. <laughs> uh, I'm really trying to, like, lose the stomach. All right, up. Breathe, breathe, breathe. My, my stomach looks bigger because of the, um, the thing. Bring it back down. Whew. Breathe, breathe, breathe. We got one more. That's the last one. Last one. Breathe. 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 This works out of sweat, though. Bring it back down. All right, so this is good for, and going to child's pose. Okay. This is good for, um, for headstands. I mean, yeah, headstands and handstands is to make your arms stronger 
So when you get into the handstand, you know, all right. And all of you want to bring your arms, you can bring your arms out like this and put it behind you this way. But I like my arms in front of me. So we're gonna stay here and catch our breath, okay? All right, and lift your hands up a little bit like this just to get a nice little stretch. Okay, and bring it back down. I'm going to stay here for a little bit. Don't fall asleep. <laughs> Don't fall asleep. I'm going to stay here for a little bit. And breathe. Get your nice breaths in. All right, we're going to do a, a stretch or a exercise that we haven't done in a while. All right, so now I'm going to go into tabletop pose. I'm going to take a few can cows. Okay. All right, downward facing dog. Y'all, downward facing dog back. Oh. Sorry, y'all. Okay, sorry, y'all. Oh, my light fell. Okay, then we're facing dog. I'm sorry, I had to check on Lovey. All right, now we're facing dog. We're going to do four of these. Then we're dog split. Here. Two. Three. Four. Bring it back down. Then we're dog split. One, two, three, four. Down into child's pose. And breathe. We haven't done that in a minute. Oh, huh? well, it's over early. My light done fell. My light fell. I was checking on Lovey. We're going to take a nice breath. I need to take a nice breath. Hmm. All right, so now we're going to thread the needle. So we're going to take the right arm, bring it up, and then we're going to bring our hand through here, and we're going to be here. That's called thread the needle. Nice little stretch. Now we're going to do the other side. Take the left up and bring it through and breathe and breathe and breathe all right now we're going to go into downward facing dog and we're gonna do some lunges you're going to jump or walk your to your hands i'm gonna jump i'm gonna Go down here, look up, flat back, bring it back down, and we're going to go into warrior one. So your foot, okay, so yeah, your foot should be, your foot should be like this, your back foot should be pivoted, I'm sorry y'all, back should be pivoted, okay, all right. So I'm gonna do warrior one, so I'll hold on so y'all can see me. All right. Okay. So warrior one, zero one, zero two, 
gaze over your middle finger, your juicy one. Make sure everything is aligned correctly. Make sure your knees are not going over your toes. Hold your stomach in and breathe. One million hands down. Bring your left foot back. Then I bring your right foot in between your hands. Pivot the back foot. Bring it up. Zero two. Zero one. Zero two. Zero one. One million hands down. Back to downward facing dog. And you want to take your left leg and we're going to do a low lunge. So hold on. We're going to do a low lunge here. If you can, if you can't, that's fine. Bring it up. If you could bring it back, go ahead. All right. And bring it back here. Come back up. Bring it back here. All right. Back into downward facing dog. Take your right foot. Little lunge. Little lunge if you can. If you can, that's fine. Bring it back. Oh, Lord Jesus. <laughs> oh, this wind. I mean, this uh, fan. Oh, I got good reflexes. <laughs> Bring it back here. Again. And bring it back here. All right. Down in two child's pose. All right. Now we're going to start getting ready for Savasana. All right. So we're going to do a nice stretch. Bring your, oh Lord, why does um, ooh, I'm getting beat up by the um, by the thing. Maybe if I leave it like this. Hold on, hold on, y'all. Let me let me let me let me fix this. I'm getting beat up by the um light. Hold on. Maybe if I hold it tight like this with the door, it won't fly all over. The... Hold on, y'all. Hold on, y'all. Be in your child's pose. Hey, I'm getting beat up by the um by the thing. All right, yeah. Let me bring it down that way. Okay. <laughs> I got beat up by the light like twice. All right, I had to bring it down. All right, so um I forgot what I was gonna do. Um oh yeah. So we're gonna do a stretch and um hopefully this light don't um blow over. <laughs> <laughs> I got beat up twice. <laughs> um, have your left arm going over your right arm. And this is like a nice side stretch, nice side side body stretch right here. And um <laughs> oh, bring it over here. Do the same thing. Put your right arm over your left. Oh my goodness. That was so funny. <laughs> oh Lord. I got beat up three times by the light. Like, oh my goodness. I'm not editing that out. <laughs> oh Lord, the light was be was beating me up, y'all. All right, so going out child's pose, and so it won't beat me up again. I'm gonna open it up wide like that. Okay. All right, child's pose. Okay. Ooh, that was crazy. <laughs> oh, got beat up. Beat up by the light. All right, now we're going to lay down, but before we lay down, we're gonna go into like a boat pose and lay down. So I'm gonna slowly go down, 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 and bring it down. All right, now we're gonna do a little bit of stretches here. Take your right leg and press it here. That was kind of like my background fell on me on my first live. That was crazy. Now the light beat me up. Oh, Lord. I'm going to mess with my allergies, too. 
All right, if you want to further stretch, do the take the figure four, bring your arm here and flex both the feet. And you get that nice stretch right here. Okay. Again, listen to your body. If you can't do it, that's fine. Do not push yourself. If you push yourself, push it, push yourself to where your body feels comfortable. If your body is in pain or you feel sharp pains, please stop at this instant. Please. I don't want anybody going to the urgent hospital. I mean, or the urgent hospital to urgent care or the hospital. Bring it down. Other foot. Flex the foot. Open up the hip a little bit. Do the figure four. Flex both the feet. Get that nice stretch. If you can get here, if not, that's fine. Stay in a neutral position. All right. Bring the feet down. Now I'm gonna do some some more hip thrust. I mean, some not hip thrust, but. Um, some like mini little bridges. So here we go. We're gonna do four of them. Again, make sure that your feet are kind of close to the buttocks, like fist, fist, um, fist apart, fist apart from the buttocks to the heels. Bring it up. Breathe. Your chin is tucked in a little bit. Bring it back down. Two. Breathe. Hold your stomach in. Down. Three. Bring that down, four, back down. All right, now we're going to bring the legs down and we're going to have our hands up into Savasana unless you guys want to, before you get a Savasana, oh, before you get a Savasana, if you want to do um, anything, get some water. I'm about to get some water out of the freezer. Get your water out of you, and then if you want to get into a pose before you get into um, Savasana to get prepared for that. Ah, it's nice. It's not frozen, it's cold. I usually don't like cold water, I like room temperature water. All right. The pose that I'm going to do before I get to Savasana, okay? So, I hope y'all thinking about a pose or if y'all did it already, cool. If y'all chilling, cool. <sighs> um, let's see if I can get into this pose. I didn't do enough stretching for this. But, let's try it. I'm going to do a compass pose. And I'm going to have to do it on the other side. But it's going to be so hard on the other side. But this is so you guys can see my struggle. YouTube then made me be great. It was like, do it. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. All right, I'm gonna do it. Don't, don't be trying to play me YouTube. All right, it's not as as good as I wanted to get, but we gonna try the side. <laughs> we gonna try the other side. So whatever you do on one side, you gotta do on this other side. This one is gonna be so hard. Hold on. Hold on. Okay. All right. So that was. Oh, Lord. Let me take a sip of water for that. <laughs> All right. So don't do that. Please don't do that. <laughs> um, but yeah. All right. So do that when you can. All right. Now we're going to get to Savasana. That's one of my favorite poses, too. I love compass poses. When I get more of a stretch, I get into it like easier than that. Bring your hands, palms facing up, your feet going off to the side. And you're going to close your eyes and you're going to fall into Savasana. As your breathing gets slower and steady. And as your eyes close and you unclench your teeth, relax your tongue, relax your facial muscles. As you hear the sound of your breathing and focusing on whatever intention that you had over your practice for tonight. As you're breathing and relaxing and taking in the breath that you had. It's 
So just breathe and relax as you seal in your practice for tonight. Breathe and breathe and relax. Close your eyes and relax. As you wiggle your fingers and you wiggle your toes, as you slowly come out of Savasana and coming back to reality, as you roll over to your right or left side, whichever you feel comfortable, to make your way up to a seated comfortable position. And as you're getting up, you're going to bring your hands to heart center in prayer. And we're going to breathe in, breathe out. And the next breathe out is going to be, we're going to end the class in the sound of OM. Um. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in. OM. Um. Thank you for joining and participating and supporting my class for today. I hope you have gotten something out of this. I hope that it was positive and I hope you're bringing out positive energy out into the atmosphere and I hope that everything is okay with you and everyone else that surrounds you and continue to be peaceful and continue to be yourself and spreading positivity and throwing the negative energy all the way out the window. Namaste. Thank you everybody for coming. I really, oh my hair, crazy. I really appreciate it a lot. Um, yes, the funny moments with, with the light. I got beat up like three times, so I really apologize about that. Sorry about the fan because I have the fan in the hallway. Um, I have the air conditioner in my room, but um, don't have the fan. I don't have air um air conditioner in the hallway, so the fan was going on. So I really apologize that it's like an attic fan. Okay, so, yeah, so sorry about that noise. But other than that, yeah, that's basically about that. So I will try to come back on next Monday um, live. If not, I will definitely update you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you got something out of the practice tonight. I hope you have gotten further in your practice. I hope your body was letting you be able to get into certain positions that your body allows you to. And again, this is your practice. You have the right to you know um have your body just to say no okay um whatever poses that you don't get to in this practice you may get in the next practice or probably five or ten practices from now so that's okay all right so i hope you guys enjoyed um thank you again i will try to do an upload this week if not um please i apologize um i but i will be back i'm trying to stay consistent with the lives again the chat is disabled you are not blocked if you want to see um why i disabled the chat you could definitely check out the video that i will have linked down below or i'll have it in i'm gonna have it in the end card so you guys can check it out but that is my choice and i am happy with my choice so that's just basically it you guys so i hope you guys enjoyed thank you so much for joining and um if you have any questions or comments you could definitely comment after this video is up and i hope you enjoyed and, and um that's just basically it about that all right all right and if you have any um poses that you would like me to do and work on and introduce the class you could definitely let me know and we can work on that together okay so that's just basically it you guys i hope you have a wonderful wonderful blessed day blessed time whenever you're watching this um i sound like i'm ending it like my videos so i apologize about that all right thank you guys for watching namaste um be blessed have a positive positive week peace bye